Welcome back to the Road Show this morning in the buzz. You probably noticed something a little different or a lot different on your Facebook page. A lot of users on Facebook getting a little confused, a little angry because they just keep changing it up, all right? Stop. Yesterday, many users got notified that they weren't going hey, to get the kind of email notifications they've gotten in the past. Facebook has also been making changes to their news feeds as well, which I find incredibly annoying. Yeah. And now photos are displayed like that, though. Bigger, better photos, I think. Okay, I need to stop. <laughs> as well as changing how friend lists are done. Some lists are automatically compiled by what the website is observing you do every day. Others you can still make on your own. But again, people are just getting confused. I think it's unnecessary, and I think that people get annoyed with all the changes and having to adjust with it. I don't think there's a social network that's even good to me anymore. It's all going downhill. Right, and people don't like, they, they want to see everything. They feel like, wow, there's something going on that I'm missing. I can't see that full list right now. <sighs> so we asked you on Facebook, love it, hate it. We got nearly 100 responses, most people saying, big dislike. I haven't noticed it. Oh my gosh, how can you not? not notice I don't it. spend nearly as much time on it as you two do. That's okay, clearly I'm within sorry. five seconds you notice right. the difference. It's no, like I'm kidding. totally different. I, I do, I'm on it yeah. quite a bit, and I honestly haven't, what, what am I, no, what's different? I'm not being a joke in here. I'm well, if you're staring at pictures me? of yourself all morning, maybe you won't <laughs> notice the changes. However, if you really like broaden your horizons, that news feed is like ticking away. Wait, on did the did right his not, side. are people... Some people's not changed. Maybe yours didn't change. Well, I know when they do these changes that sometimes it, they, they kind of do it in, in, in cycles. If and you've I left it up and you haven't shut it since, you probably still have the shut old it. one. No, I honestly, I have not noticed a change. I know it's coming probably, but I haven't noticed it. I yeah, like you'll notice. Other things like, do you no. want this? Do you want this? My problem with it is that they force you to opt in, and then you have to go through all these steps yes. to opt out. Right. And it's like, I just can't count on it. No. I feel like every week I log in and I have to relearn where mm -hmm. everything is. And it makes me feel like maybe I'm old. Like maybe the younger generation just flows with it. They know it out. Those girls, those were like 20 somethings who are saying they're sick of it too. Everybody gets into a comfort zone, right? All right? And, and the way you social media with people, you don't want to have to keep changing that all the time. Plus, I think it's too much. Yeah. I just want to focus on one person at a time. It's almost like when you're watching like a CNN or a Fox News and you get the ticker and you get this and you get that. Yes. It's like, oh, I can't think. Right. You know? You can't. I can't. You just can't I do don't it. like how they like try and figure out who's your friend in this yeah. group and the whole like facial recognition stuff. That's, That's a little weird. Out. I know. I'm getting close to being done with Facebook, I think. I'm feeling it a little bit, too. Just because of the, the whole point of it was, I reconnected with a ton of college right, friends right. that, you know, we all kind of go through that same thing where we have, you know, most of us who get married, have kids, mm. you just lose touch with a lot right. of people, high school, whatever. But uh, it is getting, like, there's people that I know I'm friends with that I haven't seen any of their things Updates and for stuff, yeah. right. months. And that maybe they're not on it, or maybe that has something to do with the change. I don't know. No, I don't know. I mean, I look through, and now I'm at the point where I have to actually search out somebody to see if they posted an update because I can't find it. Mm -hmm. it's, I don't know, lost. It's too much. Facebook world. What about this Google thing? You know, I mean, I have a hard enough. People no can't, you can't monitor no. too many, all these sites. You know what I mean? I think Facebook became so huge so fast that I think people are just going to probably stick with it and not opt for some of these yeah. other things. I mean, things, I looked into know? the Google yeah. thing and I don't know. It is. It's too much. Yeah. I mean, between like tweets and Facebook mm -hmm. and blogging and all. I mean, I just we don't can't have time for the real it. world anymore. Right. I get mad at people because they're always on their phone or, you know, on Facebook. Like, hello. I got a <laughs> real <laughs> person with a pulse right here. <laughs> That's true. You know? And even my kids sometimes are like that. Can you get off your phone? Because I'm looking, always looking right. at yeah. it. And I'm, you know, it's. I got It's maybe it's a good thing that this is getting more complicated. How about the circle? They say you need, you only need 60 people in your circle. And think of how many people we have in our circle on Facebook. It's like mm -hmm. hundreds. We can't. We can't do it. We just Thousands. can't. Thousands. Time to drop. <laughs> All right, Courtney, what do you think? I mean, are you liking these changes? You're on online a lot more than we are. I'm exhausted. Because, <laughs> like, you know, I, I help out with our Roadshow Facebook right. page. I have my own page and Twitter and YouTube channels. It is a lot indeed. So these changes are just too much for me to keep up with and relate to all of you. We do have... 81 comments from yesterday, another 10 or so today on our Facebook page, and lots of grumpy viewers we have. So let's start on the live blog on foxprovidence.com. Jean said, it's a pain in the neck, and I'm considering dropping it. Joe said, I do like the bigger photos in the stream. The other way was way too small. 
And this one here is from Guest. It said, technology is a science that is always changing, so users must adjust to any change, whether we like it or not. Let's take a look at the poll today, and we asked you, what do you think of the new Facebook changes? A, I love it, it's so simple to use. B, I don't like it, but I'll get used to it. Or C, this change could make me leave Facebook. So speaking of Facebook, let's take a look at our wall today. And this first one is from Kevin Oliver. He said, I think that people need to remember it's just Facebook. It's not life. If you don't like it, delete it. Robin Russo Peck says, not crazy about the changes, but it certainly gave everyone something to post about yesterday. And then Donna Stanley said, not a fan, don't fix what, what's not broken. And Lisa Rose says, confusing. So I haven't seen anybody actually love it yet, but yeah, we'll give it a day or two. We'll, we'll see what they'll complain about next, but we're going to head into the kitchen now. With